All right, so I'm gonna try it again. So I don't know if the other version of the game saved. If not, this is Cuckoo's. I'm gonna redo the intro real quick, okay? And All right, one sec, I need to explain something. So I actually played this game for five minutes at the beginning of this Let's Play, and then all of a sudden the game decided to close out and I lost all those five minutes of footage. Now, there wasn't too much loss, so I think I can save this Let's Play. So I hope that you guys enjoy, and this is me on my second attempt playing Cuckoo. Let's do it. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to Cuckoo, an indie horror game that I found on itch.io while looking for games to add to our vast collection of indie horror games. So, I'm not too sure of my previous file save because it just closed out for some reason, but there are creepy, scary little monsters in this game that want to stop us from surviving. And in order to stop them, we must find clocks around the house and gain time in order to survive so that is the whole idea to run this game and that is what we're going to try to do so there is the clock now i think i wonder if i don't get this clock initially did i get you okay i got you yeah okay so as soon as i do it he spawns in all right all right all right all right we're good we're good. So, uh, I, the other game should have saved. If not, I'm not too sure. Uh, then it's, it's going to look like I already know what's happening, because I do. There's a creepy, scary man following me around my house right now. That is that is it. And apparently, I have to try to escape. But uh, how I do that, I do not know. All I know is that there is a creepy, scary thing there, and it's not wanting me to live. So, I will indeed try to run from this creepy, scary thing man. Deb, if you are watching this, you gotta make it where it takes you back to a main menu or something because I ex I hit that button in the hopes that it would take me back to a main menu, even though it's an exit from game. It fucked up my recording. So some people's recording systems will mess up and then you'll get less people playing the game. So do keep that in mind that you should probably have it exit you to a menu or something. So I know this room is just a mirror room, so there's nothing in there. Oh, no. Oh, that's it. One minute. Fuck. All right, we're gonna give one more shot. So I do need to get this right off the bat, and then we just keep moving because he's right behind us. Also, um, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know if the first part of me recording this got deleted or not. So I am running the game in 12 by 720. If so, and I'm running it very low, so it probably looks a lot better than what it does right now. So if you guys want to try that out, go check it out on itch and uh, play it, because I have to run it in a lower resolution. Oh, this is a new room. Oh, 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 new room, new room. You got some clocks in here for me? You have clocks. I'm looking for the clock man to increase my livability time. All right, there's gotta be some kind of clock around here, right? There's some kind of room over here too, so. I don't think there's an actual clock in here. Oh, nope, haven't been this way before. Alright, hello, man, scary man living in my hallway. You have any clocks back here? Do you have any clocks? I. <gasps> nope, 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 nope. nope. Alright, I don't get what we're supposed to do. I don't see there, uh, there's any clocks. Uh, let's just get down this way then, and hopefully there's a clock in here or we are dead. Clock man. Clock, man. <gasps> clock! No! <laughs> there was a clock! <sighs> Again! Alright, alright. Now that I know for a fact that there is another clock down this hallway, then I'm gonna keep going. Knowing that I can do it. I wonder what I am though. Am I a kid or am I a... What the hell? Wait, what? The house changes? Uh... Okay, alright. Something special happens after every clock. What happens this time? Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh shit. Alright, what is in here? Alright, there's a test tube. I think. 
Uh, find the four buttons. Red, blue, yellow. Oh, okay. All right, all right. There's the room. Ah! Ah! No, two! Okay, oh, there's two of them. All right, all right. We got to find red, yellow. There's the yellow in the corner over there. I see the blue. All right, all right, we can do this. If I just don't stop moving. All right, where's the red? Where is the red? Oh, red's right here. All right, red. There you go. All right. Now purple. Ah, no. No. No, no, scary man for me. All right, I did it. Oh, oh, that's nice. Oh, this is so much better. Did I really just open up the door? Is that all that did? Did I just open up a doorway? Oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, so I saw a minute, but now I have two of them behind me. So now that I know this house is an interchanging dimension hole of hell, that lets me know that I can't approach this rationally because if I do, I am probably not going to survive from it. And this looks like an. Oh, that looks like a clock. Oh, 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 it's changing, it's changing, it is so changing, it is changing so hard, alright, we got it, we get it, we get it, don't even worry about it guys, I am the ultimate man of destruction, awesome, watch like, because I'm running the very low graphics, like the real graphics look like fucking Resident Evil 7 or something, alright, so that connected that way, does that mean I can get out now, no, Okay, so okay, so I know what we'll have to do now. Now that now that I know the clocks actually just correspond to different locations around the house, maybe that means I go this way now. Ah, shit. Okay. All right, they got us. All right. Well, we're gonna leave it there. So this was Cuckoo, an indie game that I found on itch. Like I said at the beginning. Sorry if the beginning is a little bit weird, since the game actually says press space to exit to the game. Exit the game. It actually literally means exit the game. It won't take you to the main menu. Any people who are recording this and actually make it to the very end of my let's play, and you're trying to record it. Do not close it out if you're running a program that will not capture a game after it closes, because that's probably going to cause problems for me editing this. So. Do be careful. But for now, I'm going to leave this one here. If you guys want to play it, I will leave the link to this game down below in the description. Cool game. Needs a little bit more polish, I think. Uh, the FPS dropped for me, but that's probably just because it's me and my computer. So if you guys want to try it out, by all means, check it out. I will also leave links to some more indie horror games. Gosh! I just tell people in my house I just can't swear very loud. But do check the links down below to my indie horror games and other indie games that I've done. I hope that you enjoy those as well. And I will see you guys in the next one. Keep dreaming. Goodbye, guys.